Oh, you want to eat out with your family once a month? Well, if you uh, if you don't do that, I broke down the math for you, idiot. Like you flunked out of elementary and you can't do math. So here's the math. Um, if you don't ever get coffee, if you don't ever eat out, um, you'll save $250 a year. Over 10 years, that's 2,500. Did the math for you again, dumbass. Um, over 100 years, that's, uh, you know, that's, that's 10 times all that. So that's 25,000. Wowzers. So if you save money for, for 100 years by not doing these things that are quality of life, you save $25,000. What are you, poor? That's the kind of shit I'm talking about. Oh, it's just losing it. Oh, ooh. Where's the small one? Ooh. RNG? Oh my god, I just saved. I've never saved that much time. I didn't know that you could save that much time. That was six seconds faster than last round. Five or six seconds. I didn't know that was possible. Oh my god. Come on, oh, it's if that loser nerd Scotty can do it. <laughs> Scotty alone, shit. But you're right. All right, I'm going for the SEX skip. I'm doing it. What? Well, okay, never mind. I'll break even. Now, whether or not I'm successful, I definitely won't be successful, but... If I'm successful once, the chat's gonna always say, Yo, dude, you going for that skip again for the world record? Uh-huh, yeah. Oops. Yo, we got this? I slipped? It is, because, because DoorDash hardly pays anything, and then they say, Oh, if you don't tip... Um, your food might not be delivered in time. Albert, this is true. You don't tip your door, dra door dash next time. Your food's going to be thrown on your front porch or your front lawn. It's going to say delivered and half of it's going to be eaten. If it's not the first time, it will be the fifth time somewhere in there. One to five times. So don't, don't hit me with what's wrong with you. Do it. Don't, don't tip your DoorDash driver, and I don't even blame them. You're just the, you're the unfortunate person that has to take the anger in brunt of, brunt of it. I don't even blame them, because they don't get paid shit. DoorDash encourages you to tip, and then DoorDash tells you, oh, if you're not going to tip, your driver's going to take longer, because they don't pay their workers. You pay them via tips because they just want a higher profit margin.